DeepSeek V3.1. I'm a little bit late on this subject, but let's test it. Create a dot to dot puzzle game of a penguin in a self contained HTML file. Not bad, but let's see if it looks like a penguin. One, two, well, oh, here's the three. Hmm, interesting. Four, five. <laughs> this is not going to work. 19. 20. Uh, what? <laughs> well, okay, this penguin actually looks pretty good, but the actual game doesn't make any sense at all. This is obviously a fail, but I'll give four. Make a 3D penguin simulation in a self-contained HTML file. It should have mountains and a ground where the penguins get together when it's too cold. Give me a slider for the climate temperature. Use 3JS. All right, it finished. So let's run this. Well, doesn't look too bad. The penguins does look like penguins. We have mountains. They spread. And when it's cold, they get together. In fact, they get so together that they merge together and become this powerful being that can spin forever. <laughs> a few glitches, but does work. I'm gonna say this is a pass, but barely. I'm gonna give six. Make me a dashboard in a self-contained HTML file to track my finances. It must have an income field and an expenses field with the date selection, a pie chart and a line chart to see my net growth over time. Give me the ability to save in a JSON file. Okay, so this is the result. Let's run here. I'm already negative here, <laughs> but that was me. That was not the thing I tried to delete and it didn't work. But what does work? Okay, it adds, nice. And it shows a graph. Okay, so it does work. As you can see, pretty nice. I haven't seen a one shot result like this in a long time. So this is a pass and score of 10, actually nine because of that mistake there. Create a simple calculator app using Python and PyQt. Give me a single Python file. Okay, so it finished. Here's the code and it gave me an error. So didn't even open the calculator. I'm not going to give a second chance on this very simple task. So this is a fail, a score of zero. <laughs> Create a photo editing app using Python and PyQt. It should have a white balance color picker, hue and saturation sliders, adjustment curves, layers with blending modes, text and brush. Give me a single Python file. So it finished. This is the code. Let's copy the code. And here it is. Not bad. Can it brush? Oh, yes. <laughs> this is the first time I see the brush working. Does the eraser work? Yes, it does. Can I change the size? Ah, yes. Nice. So it works. Can I remove the layer? Yes. This is my profile picture. So let's try changing the opacity. Yes. Wow. It works. It's pretty smooth, actually. Change the hue. Mm, the hue doesn't work. Saturation also doesn't work. Curves apparently also doesn't work. Almost did it. So this is a fail. I'm going to give score of five because almost did it. There are two penguins in front of a penguin, two penguins behind a penguin and a penguin in the middle. How many penguins are there? The answer should be three. Well, after thinking for five minutes, it came into the right conclusion. So this is a pass. Score of 10. Translate this text into English for me. So this is a Chinese expression. This is correct. This is a pass. Score of 10. Now, this is a Portuguese phrase with colloquial language. Let's see if it can translate. So it can piss out. I like this. This is a pretty good equivalent to this expression here. So this is a pass score of 10. Write me a story of a cyborg penguin trying to conquer the world. So this is the result. I won't read all of it, but you can pause and read it 
if you want. Okay? It's a pass. I'm gonna give I'm gonna give nine. Usually Chinese models are pretty good at this. Now you are me and I am a girl, you're trying to win over. We have never talked to each other before. We are chatting in a texting app like WhatsApp. Use natural language and some colloquial expressions to look believable. Say okay if you understood. The chatting begins after I say hi. I don't think I need deep think for this. It said okay, but said hi as well. It shouldn't. But anyway, let's keep going. Hi. This was not bad. It was not trying to say too much, which I like. Negative points for the emoji. I don't like emojis. But anyway, just chatting. Nice, me too. So what are you up to right now? Just chilling? I'm hungry. Ooh, same. I'm literally staring into my fridge, hoping for something good to magically appear. <laughs> I think this is a pass. But uh, barely, I'm gonna give six for this one. Okay, so this is the final score. So 69 out of 100 for the DeepSeek V3.1. So this is the comparison with all of the other models I tested. Not bad at all. Oh my God, we did a lot of benchmarks already. Crazy. It came in fifth place. We have 15 benchmarks. So let me know what you think and don't forget to subscribe.